Hi guys, welcome back to the Game and Party channel, and we're doing another unboxing video. And who is this from here? Let's see. Hello from Portal Games. Ooh, what could this be? Let's take a look and see. Alright, so I've already gone ahead and cut off the tape off the box to make it a little easier, and... Let's see what's in the box. Ooh. All right. Lots of bubble wrap on here. Predator Porter. Uh oh. Or as Erica likes to call it, Predator Porter. <laughs> if you don't get that joke, you should watch our podcast, all right? Gameandparty.com slash podcast. All right. So, what do we have here? Modern Times. All right. So, looks like some extra instructions here. Not sure why those are outside the box, but it's got some extra instructions here with it. And some extra cards. I believe these are some extra promo cards that came with the Kickstarter. This is a Kickstarter I backed, by the way. And oh, pull the box out. Nothing else in here. Make sure I don't miss anything. Nope. So there we go. Well, that's a thick box too. It doesn't close all the way. Looks like they want to punch you out at will. All right, one of those thematic economic games. This is a fashion design game. So, not a theme you see in a lot of games, but I can't wait to get this out. This is a, uh, a Euro game with that kind of theme. So let's, let's open this up and see what it looks like inside of the box here. All right. Ignacy Trebicek, that's how you say that, I think. Close as I can get it. All right, thank you for backing it. All right, cool. Gives you a little list of things that you're getting here. Classic insert, uh, alternate design cards, nice. 96 screen printed wooden pieces. Ooh, that's nice. Lots of good stuff in this one here. Starting cards, and a little message from Ignacy himself. Very nice. Instruction booklet here. Lots of artwork inside the instruction book. Looks like it's broken down piece by piece for you here. So a lot going on here. This is a 19-page uh, a instruction book here for this game. So it is not a uh, it's not a simple game by any means. But I'm looking forward to getting this to the table quickly here. Lots of components here. You see them all listed here in the instructions. Lots of components. So let's. Ooh. There's, uh, this looks like the money in the game, probably. Credit cards, these are credit cards. <laughs> There's all, oh, credit cards are five ones. There you go, it's modern times now, folks. It's not, uh, it's not paper money, it's credit cards. Lot to punch out here, you can see. Player boards looks like you can punch out also. Lots of good stuff in the game. Oh, here we go, There's some more credit cards for you. Some 20s, 50s, 100s. There we go. Oh, look at that, that's a nice insert. I love this. this. This is one of the nice things I like about games like this. They Not only are they showing you the insert here, they're also showing you um, what goes in the box here. So basically, this has got the little victory points there. So you can see what goes in these different areas here. It's not just a tray. It's also a tray with uh, some design on it there showing you what's going to go inside those uh, different areas, which I like. I'm glad to see that. All right, it's the board. Let's open this up and see what this looks like. All right. If I can figure out how it opens up. Opening the board is a puzzle itself, apparently. Oh, there we go. All right. Beautiful board, actually. Look at the artwork on this. This is beautiful. All right, showing you the dominations down here. I've not played this game yet, so I don't know what all these symbols mean. But I like you can see the little tape there for uh, measuring tape. Playing the numbers there, looks like. I assume this is like rounds in the game or something going on on our side here. Definitely got to get this to the table soon. Oh, this is neat. So the, the scoring track on the outside of the board here, it looks just like one of these like those, those cloth tape measures you would have like this going around outside. That's pretty cool. I like that. Little, little touches like that really make games uh, kind of stand out. So that is really cool. I like the fact that they did that. Just so I can close this without tearing it up. There we go. 
and another insert down here. So I think this insert here is gonna fit right in here. Yep, perfectly. So it's gonna fit right there, not move. This board will fit right up under there like I did, where it just pulled out from, looks like. Right. Let's see. I think I rotate it. Let's see. Yep, there we go. And that sits, yep, look at that. That is nice. So that is going to fit perfectly inside of there. The rest of the stuff will punch out. Looks like it's going to go below. All right, so here is the super nice part. Nice, big, chunky wooden pieces. That's my favorite word, chunky. Chunky wooden pieces here in the cane. These are thick. Even like the little point tokens here. Plus 100 if you pass 100 points, I assume. Hey. So the, again, little things like this. Like It's just a plus 100 here. You don't have to have artwork on the other side. This could just be blank on that side. It doesn't really matter. Uh, and But they, yet they've still put artwork on the other side of these. Uh, that is just going above and beyond, in my opinion. I love seeing that. And some more nice chunky pieces here. Again, this is probably player pieces just to basically keep your, your score and your place on the board or marking locations that you're are you going to and uh, again could it have been player color hey I'm a red player or I'm a pink player but they put artwork on these pieces here which is really cool I like seeing that in games so production value off the charts on this one here uh, let's take a look here I'll take the red ones because red's my favorite color I'm always a red player if I get a chance to be there you go there's a little spool all right little, uh, little spool there mark something on the board for you Good stuff. Wow, that is, this is nice. Cannot wait to get this to the table. It looks awesome. Uh, definitely going to break out the rules and start reading this right away and try to get this to the table uh, ASAP. We'll probably do a playthrough and uh, maybe a teach on our channel also. There you go. That is uh, Pret a Porte or Pret a Porter. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. That's what's in the game. We will see you on the next video. Take care, guys. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel. Also, check out our podcast, and you can find us on all of our social media sites on GameAndParty.com. See you on the next video.